Wow. 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 I have never been this tired. Why don't you pull over and get some sleep? I'll just sleep right here. Okay. Um, I'm allergic to coffee, by the way. That's decaf, Jason. We got your decaf. Is decaf still coffee? Thanks for driving us so early. Yeah, thanks for driving us so early. <clears throat> and for getting the coffee. Is this... No, I mean, just because I'll get hives. So don't drink it. Oh, well, what? Can't we get something else then for me? We're well, going to be there soon. I don't know why Mr. Lynch needs you to be there so early. Well, it's because he's the county chairman of all medieval activities, you know. Yeah, so, he takes um, this stuff pretty seriously. Yeah. I guess I should have packed my own juice or something. Yeah, and we are getting paid, Mom, so... Yeah. You know, you know, I actually don't really like the medieval fair. Yes, you do, Jason. No, I don't, Melissa. Yes, you do. I want to go to the sci-fi convention. What's a sci-fi convention? Uh, you know, it's a bunch of dorks trading action figures, Mom. Oh, like that thing I took you to last year? Yes. Believe you me, you two, it's not a bunch of dorks. <laughs> Anyway, this year it's happening, you know, on the same day, next door to the Medieval Fair, which is a huge conflict of interest for geeks. Hey, watch it, Brendan. Jason, aren't you more interested in the history of Medieval times? Yeah. I mean, it really happened. <laughs> so does sci-fi stuff. When, in the future? No. That's why you don't understand it. It's already happening. Kids, it's a little early to be arguing. It's gonna be fun. Yeah. Dwayne's band is gonna be there. I don't like Dwayne. You have a bad attitude today. You do. You I do. don't like Dwayne. Guys, guys, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. And, you know, I'm videotaping it. Well, so. remember when we used to play sci-fi games together? Yeah, we still play sci-fi games. Yeah, so why can't we go to the sci-fi convention? Because we're not getting paid to go to the sci-fi convention. We're getting paid to do the medieval fair, and we're performing. We're performers. Why don't we take the money and go to the sci-fi convention? And we could buy collectibles. We're already dressed for the medieval fair. Oh, is that why you guys are wearing those things? Yeah. Mom? Uh... Let's sing a song. How about oh, that? Oh, the medieval time is coming. Time to go. Good morrow. Good morrow, everyone. Are ye well rested, me shrews and frews and stablesmen? I look like yar. Well, that was an Elizabethan dialect, everyone, and uh, all of you must learn to speak it. Uh, the fairgoers will expect that from ye lot. <laughs> uh, come up here, Brendan. <clears throat> okay. Now, uh, all of you will be improvising in the character that you've dressed as, okay? Um, now, who are you, Brendan? Me. I'm King Arthur. Me lard. <laughs> See? You are the king, and I must treat you thusly. Right. And I am the wizard, Moylin. You mean Merlin? Moylin! Okay. Okay. So, treat the other characters based on how they're dressed. Remember, caste systems were big in the medieval times. Okay, like if I were to talk to, uh, let's say, um, okay, him. No, oh, no. He's an archer. No. Oh. Okay, come hither. Uh, come hither. Yeah? I, uh, thou will be an archer, eh? Um, yeah. Thou swaggart! Uh. Thou foolish tart! Fetch me an ale at once, thou scurvy-ridden, rump-fed mud sloth! Say again? And he would have to fetch, because a wizard is above a common archer in the caste system. Okay, you get it, everyone? Um, um, Robin Hood. Okay. Okay, now, Brendan, let's you and I have a conversation, okay? Everybody, okay. pay attention. Good morrow, me lard. <clears throat> By God's breath, didst thou ever see such a bootful marnin? Yeah. Aye, and watch thy steppeth in the thicket, me lard. Huh. There be archers a boot. And then I would talk. Yeah. Okay, um, all right, well, okay. all right. Yeah, oh, well, I don't know. I, okay, I don't, okay. Yeah. I, I understand okay. this is your first time. All right. A lot of first timers here, all first timers, actually, and uh, there's something you can do. If you have any problem, I've prepared this list of outs. For all of you, okay? Uh, if a character starts talking over your head, you don't understand them, pull out the list and read one of the outs. You could say, um... Okay, that's a bad one. Um, I wrote these this morning at 6, so... I, I don't understand, Dwayne. What's the problem? We want to know when we get paid. I, I thought we settled this already, Dwayne. No, cash up front. We all talk about it, cash up front, or we don't play. No, that wasn't the agreement. So? So you work first, and then I pay you. That's how it works. So? So that's what we're going to do. I don't care. Okay. Cash up front? No, no, cash later. I don't care. Uh, all right, then go away. Okay. Uh. All right, we're ready to open. Uh, Where's my blacksmith? Blacksmith! Blacksmith! Uh, come on. Um, uh, um, uh, I'm right. <laughs> uh, uh. 
McGurk, mm -hmm. you know we needed you here in working condition. Lynch, I'm just a little hungover, all right? No problem. I don't know, you look bad. I I'm gonna have to dismiss you, McGurk. Lynch, I'm fine, I'm fine. Um, oh boy. I, I don't think so. I'm fine, Lynch, I'll be fine. I just need the job, all right? I mean, the money I'm making from today is already spent. On what? On drinks and property. I met a guy last night, bought a shrimp farm. Ah, oh, McGurk, are you still gonna be able to do the big finale with me? <laughs> what? Did you learn your lines? Hmm? Yes. Yes, to what you said. Okay, okay. I don't know. I don't know. I'm ready for this thing. The final <clears throat> performance? Yeah. The wizard and the blacksmith? What? Yes. The wizard and the blacksmith. It's all set. And you'll be able to stay in character all day? Mm. Mm-hmm. Okay, give me an example. What would you say? As the blacksmith? Yes. What do you want me to, you to, want me to make you? What do you want me to make? No, you? in Elizabethan. Okay. What do you want me to make you? Oh boy. Now move. I'm gonna throw up. Good morrow, me lad. May the gods bless ye, eh? Tis a measle of hog's hoof, eh? Nay, and how doth ye find meself, me lad? Hmm? And how doth ye find yeself? Hmm? <clears throat> uh, pardon me, good sire. I must tend to a dragon elsewhere. Good morrow. Come ye all to the trilogy of King Arthur and Robin Hood, a fine piece of drama done with fiend minstrels. Perry, Perry, let's go see it. Yeah, I like Robin Hood. <laughs> <laughs> Perry, you yeah. remind me of Robin Hood. I do? Yeah. Yeah. For your beautiful skin. Really? <laughs> now, ah! Ah! No! You can't be Robin Greetings, Earthlings. You jerk! You made an apple cart fall on Walter! Whoops. <laughs> like my robot, everybody? Who be you causing problems here? I'm from the future, and I've come to blow up your planet. I run! Run from the future, man! That's right! Run, dork! <laughs> hi, Brandon. Uh, hi, Fenton. Oh, it's, uh, it's not Fenton. It's, uh, Dr. Dr. Neptune. Yeah. <clears throat> cool robot, Dr. Neptune. Yeah. I'm uh, just testing her out. Wow. I've uh, entered it into the sci-fi robot battles. <laughs> I've probably got a good chance of winning. You should come check it out, Brendan. Nah, I gotta stay and work here, sorry. Ah, uh, medieval stuff sucks. No, it doesn't. Medieval stuff is cool, Fenton. At least it really happens. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Melissa. Okay, nice nightgown. What happened? Forget the dress this morning? Uh, um, I really like your robot, Dr. Neptune. Yeah? yeah, whatever. Nice tights, loser. Your mom know you steal her clothes? Um, no. I gotta go. See you, Brendan. Bye, dorks. See you in, in the future. He's a full package. Uh, Perry? Hello? Hey, I found a way in here. Hey, Perry? Hey, there is a thing I see. I'm so glad you're here. Maybe we could live here forever. Good morrow, Lord Arthur. Well, well good morrow. Uh, you? I, uh, me name be Helmet, most magnanimous lord. Hello, fair maiden, good morrow, Robin Hood. Good morrow, Helmet. Hi, weirdo. I'm here on important business, me lord, investigating. There be tales, there be rumblings amongst the people of a future man that come here causing a ruckus. Oh, you mean Fenton? Oh, no, uh, he's fine. He come from the other camp, claiming they be sci-fi lovers knocking over Apple carts and whatnot. You know, you, you can talk regular if you want. Okay, look, I just want you guys to know that jerk who did this is gonna pay. What are you talking about? Look, I'm sorry, but those guys at the sci-fi convention are stupid dorks, and they have been pushing the medieval people around for years. Oh, well. This year, it's stopping. You know, we are drawing a line in the sand, and we're shutting those ray gun boys down. 
Well, uh, you know, uh, don't go doing anything stupid. I'm right? off! I will need to consult my dice for my next step. I'll keep you informed, my lord. Okay, don't bother. My king! Hey, you tore my dress. Sorry, wench. Did not see you there. Farewell! Wench? What's all this my lord business, Brendan? Can it stop? They're treating him like that because he's dressed as the king. Oh, it's getting annoying. Yeah, it's getting a little annoying. Hey, blacksmith, why don't you wake up and make some silver tipped arrows? Lowly blacksmith has to wake up! We command it! Yeah, Blake, uh, It's uh, been uh, commanded! You're, you're, you're supposed to be blacksmithing for it. Yeah, make a broadsword! We're noblemen, make some okay? chain we're, we're, we're part of the aristocracy. Get up, so blacksmith! Do what we think. We're losing patience! Do it, you stupid idiot! <laughs> yeah, do it, idiot! Do it, do it! Do it, idiot! Okay, do it! Do All right, it, that's it. it! That was awesome. <laughs> Many years ago, in the ancient times of England, on a fateful day where the fairies prayed and the devil crept in the shadows, two men did meet in a forest by the brook, and that day would change the fates of these two very famous men. They met and stared in silence into each other's souls. Two bad souls and their fists stood. Their egos threatened danger. Were they friends or were they foes? They could have killed each other. <laughs> but what's this? The king speaks. I decree before all of England that I, King Arthur, and Robin Hood from this point on shall be best friends forever! Oh, brilliant piece, me lord. Hey, thanks. Bit of news from the king's front, me lord. What? One of ours has infiltrated the sci-fi sector incognito. Yes, yes. Good, good. And you'll be happy to know our nemesis's robot was indeed thwarted. All in the name of good King Arthur. God save the king. God save the king. Wait, wait, wait. wait what, what, did, what did you do now? Which one of you did this? Brandon, do you know anything about this? No, no. I, 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 well, I have a pretty good idea that it was somebody from over here. Perhaps a wizard cast a spell on your devil's invention, or possibly it was cursed by an enchanted loot, or a doom goblin, or perhaps... All right, enough of that, okay, you stupid... I don't even know what you're saying. I will get to the bottom of this, and I swear that my people will get revenge for what has been done. Zap you, zap you, zap you. Good morrow, Robin Hood. King Arthur. That's me, my friend. Feels like dragon weather, doth it? Aye, aye. Something has been troubling me, my friend. Dost thou possess my money that thou borrowed from me last week? Ah, uh, nay, my lord. Couldst thou come back perhaps later? Hmm. Hast thou seen thy king's treasure chest lately? Nay, King Arthur, nay. Because I have noticed that since we've been friends, that my valuables keep disappearing. Ah, news to me. Good morrow, Robin Hood. Good morrow, Guinevere. Art thou ready for our date? Feels like dragon weather, does it not? Guinevere! Lord Arthur! Date? Ooh. Thou art my girlfriend! Robin Hood, hast thou been stealing my things and giving them to the poor? Yes. And you've stolen my girlfriend too? Yes. And you're giving her to the poor? Yes! Well, you're giving her to the poor? That's what I said, yes. Unsheath thy sword and prepare for battle. No, thou mustn't! Today we fight to the death! So be it. Robin Hood crossing the line stole off this concubine from him. Skies. A dragon approaches and there's death in his eyes. Best to join forces and fight the beast. You better join forces or you'll both be deceased! Dragon attack! Bravo.
Bravo, my king! Bravo! Hey, yeah. Thanks. As you can see, our numbers have increased. Right, right. Uh, great. It has been brought to our knowledge that there is indeed a traitor in our midst. Uh, yep. Keep thine eyes open, my king, and don't despair. My men will protect you. Great. Am I right, men? Arthur! 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 Boy, we're really killed. They're calling for the author. <laughs> you hear that, friends? Yeah, yeah. Um, guys, I'll be back, okay? Good show, me lord. Uh. <clears throat> In me opinion, t'was a weedy wayward, tottering varlet of a performance. Huh. And what does thou say to that? <clears throat> uh, farewell. Can I get one of those caramel dip scrolls? You, no, a fresh, no, a fresh one. A fresh one. It's hot. These are cold. These are cold. McGurk, you've been in there for 45 minutes. Yeah, 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 whatever. There are people lined up for the blacksmith booth. They want you back there. Lynn, shut up, all right? I'm having stomach problems. Look, get out here. Get. I, I'm paying you to play a blacksmith, not to do what you're doing. By the way, my lord, is, is, isn't this historically inaccurate? Shouldn't I be going outside in a hole in the ground? Not I, in this I, beautiful porta potty Well, I'm sure you would I be... I want one of these. Put it out my front lot. Piss off my neighbors. Look, get out here, McGurk. Get out here. I heard you, Lynch. Forget it. I'm not paying you. All right, I'm out. Boo. I'm out. Boo. What are you booing? Woo. I know, I'm oh, sorry. God. Oh. oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm sorry. That is not a wand of summoning, my friend. No, no. A wand of summoning has a pewter coil that... That's not a pewter coil! That is that is inlaid scrimshaw, which by the... Was there whaling in King Arthur's time? I don't think so. That's weird that you would have a scrimshaw. Brendan. Brendan. Fenton? Down here. What are you doing? I'm recruiting you. For what? We want you to join us. We? Affirmative. Our numbers are back, Brendan. We just need to recruit someone else from the inside. Someone else? Well, look, you're either with us or against us. Well, I just don't care. There, you know, there's always that. Join us! No. Uh, don't involve me in this, Fenton, okay? You will soon regret the decision you have made. Mark my words. Captain Neptune, away! Isn't it Dr. Neptune? Dr. Neptune away! All right. Oh, no, man. I could barely walk out of there. I didn't know. It's McGurk. called a cab. I was McGurk. like, there was no way. McGurk, put that away. What? Put the phone away. I'm on the phone, Lynch. It doesn't exist. What? Lynch, I don't want to have a philosophical conversation with you right now. G what? The f give me that. Hold on. Give me that. What? Lynch, give me my phone back. Who is this? Hello? G give it back. No, he's he's making horseshoes. Lynch, give me my I phone back. Really? Lynch. Renaissance. I okay, good. I I wow. Uh, Moylan has a phone! Really okay, good Everybody! Moylan has a phone! McGurk, shut up! Burn him! McGurk, shut Burn up! Burn him! Burn McGurk. him alive! Uh, sir, you acknowledge that you are talking to a chaotic neutral, eighth level, half elf ranger illusionist, and you treat me with that respect! I did not sew these leather breeches myself so that I can't get a goblet of non-alcoholic mead when I ask for it! Oh, mighty Odin, where is thy cleansing thunderbolt? Brendan. Yeah? Don't have a drink the night before a medieval fair. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Drink during. That's what I should have done. Okay, well, anyway, back to me. Look, so Fenton and Helmer are both involving me in this stupid geek fight. I, mean, I don't know, you yeah, know. so? So I don't want to be involved. So they're dorks. Let them fight. It'd be funny. You ever seen two dorks fight? It's hilarious. Yeah. Yeah, you know what? Everybody's saying that there's a traitor around and stuff, and then these kids are... These kids are weird, and they might do something stupid, you know? You know what looks good, Brendan? What's that? The sci-fi Oh, thing. not you, too. Ugh. What? That's what I'm talking about. Everyone's fighting against sci-fi and the Brendan. medieval... Brendan! Brendan! What? That's the way it was. The medieval people fought with the sci-fi people. It's been thousands of years of that. Yeah. That's why they're doing this. It's a reenactment. It's just, Coach, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I mean, Brendan. What? Well, what would you do? Brendan, look. What? Here's four dollars. Go across the field and go to that burger place and get me a double burger with cheese. All no, right? Coach, you're not supposed to have... Large fries, curly coach, fries. Coach, they didn't curly have... Curly fries, Brendan. They didn't have curly fries back in medieval times. I can't Brendan, do Brendan, we're not, not in medieval times, all right? But... Turn your head, look. There's the burger place. You can see it from here. Oh, wait, there's a car. It just drove by. No, now it's going into the drive-thru. Why are you yelling at me? Because go get me one. All right. You want one? Yes. And so the dragon has been slain. 
And now King Arthur and Robin Hood must decide If they still want to do what they were going to do And fight to the death So you were the traitor, Melissa? Yep. And so what, you got the robes and you let them into the fair? Yeah. Wow, Melissa, sometimes you impress me. Yeah, well. Yeah, yeah, but see, why? You didn't seem to care about that sci-fi stuff at all, you know? Oh, I don't. Well, then why did you do it? Brendan Helmet ripped my dress and he called me a wench. Oh. Yeah, you rip a girl's dress, you call her a wench, you're asking for it. Oh, girl power. Very <laughs> good, yes. Power Thanks. to the ladies. Yeah. Brendan, I stole this. Is that a pig's head? Yeah, it's not. It's ceramic. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna give it to my dad. Take it off, Jason. Don't eat me. So what are you guys talking about? Nothing. 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 Brendan, how was the fair? Oh, uh, actually it was pretty much the same as last year. Perry? Oh, yeah? This is the best day I've ever had. Can I walk? Oh, can I, Perry? 